And we have a tattoo topic this weekend. What do you wish tattoo collectors were more educated on? Well, well that's a hard one. Hmm, that's a good question. It is, right? My first category will be small color. Time. How, how do you mean? How like long the a tattoo is going to take? Oh my god, yeah. right? Yeah, totally. How to approach a tattoo artist about their idea so that the tattoo artist is interested and will listen. To be honest with you, the only problem I have is looking at me as a person, you know what I'm saying? And especially as a black man in the industry, it's kind of hard, you know what I'm saying? So people need to stop some time and look over that and yeah. look at the artwork it's instead. Right. Exactly, it explains for itself. Probably the same thing as everybody else, just the safety about it all, yeah. you know? Knowing where to go and not just going to somebody at a house or... Not doing it yourself. Exactly, oh yeah. I've always said that, you know, if you truly know body piercing, you will never do it to yourself because yeah. it's it's there's a lot more involved with it. Yeah. I wish they would stop acting like they knew everything oh about gosh. tattoos. Right? Can we just go? Because uh, then they're the ones starting to like give aftercare advice to like artists. I get it all the time. You're like, shut up, man. And the difference between like styles, you know, you can ask anyone to do a rose, and depending on you know who you're going to, it's going to be a different looking rose, you know. Healing. <laughs> Healing. So important. But actually, um. Uh, most of the serious collectors are very in tune with their healing. Yeah, I mean, obviously, like what the pers person's portfolio looks like, you know, like, I mean, obviously, cleanliness is a big deal, you know, yes. like, probably taking care of the tattoo. Aftercare. Like, Super just, important. yeah, like, or like, especially in California, like, I hate when I do a tattoo and they come back, uh, like, a month later and it's fucking burnt. They look like yeah. Hulk Hogan skin. Uh, lovers' names, uh, wedding rings. I just made some Amway salesman so pissed off in the elevator yesterday. But it was one of the funnest things I got to say. Uh, he, he, was, he was asking me about getting the band on the bottom of the finger and if it would stay. I told him it wasn't worth it and then I asked him, well, you're not thinking about your, your wedding ring? He says, yes, of course I am. I didn't know. I asked him then why he was thinking about getting divorced and he said he wasn't. That's why he was thinking about getting the ring. But then I pointed out to him that would just cause the divorce. I think the first thing to say is that you're really looking for input from your artist. You have some concepts and ideas, but you'd be interested in like having them do their own thing with it. Yeah. Planning like the sleeve. If, if you want a banger from me, you're going to come back a month later and ask me to turn it to a sleeve. Yeah. Let me know ahead of time because I might be, you know, stepping on my own feet. Quality. Uh, Quality, yeah. yeah, we were. We were, I was actually talking outside with her about that, and people will convince themselves that shit is gold oh my and goodness. think that. Um, this, a hack job piece is as good as a Roman piece, and they actually believe. They believe it. And it's not. Like and it's kind of, it, it's horrible and kind of embarrassing sad. for our industry to have that happening. So they should actually use the tools that they have and the internet research. and research who they're going to. Right? So that when I tell them six hours, they don't look at me like I'm crazy. Girl, I want it in 30 minutes. Yeah. <laughs> I got yeah. places to be. Yeah, we're not, <laughs> this isn't fucking Miami Inc. Yeah. Right? And that's edited. People need Seriously. to know. Seriously. <laughs> Them deciding that they need to take all these pills and side effects, you know, just sit there for the tattoo. I think that that's the sense where, again, it's the same thing, is that they forget that they need to hold still yeah. and it becomes just a pain in the ass. I think a lot of people have good ideas and they email someone and they never hear back yeah. because the way that they phrased it almost just sounds dead or, or boring. And I'm like, what the hell? What did what you do? This is beautiful when you left. This is awesome. What the hell happened? And they went straight to the river or the beach and oh gosh, burnt it, so that's good. the one thing I don't like. So it's like, you know, people look at my work all the time, they're like, man, I love your work, I follow you for a long time, I want this really realistic rose. And I'm like, no, I don't do realism. Like, I don't really do realism ever. I mean, like, <laughs> like, like a clean shop, I think, is like probably like pretty key because there's like some dirt bags in the world today, you know, and uh, uh, yeah, you don't want to come up with some funky shit growing on your. You don't want to wake up with your dick glued to your stomach because you got a tattoo somewhere. 